Dexy. De what My the? My journey was successful. Dexian. What, what's going on? Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. And welcome back to Skyrim. This is Hill. And before we get into today's uh, topic, I just want to thank everyone for subscribing to my channel, the new subscribers. I see the numbers going up. Thank you so much. Please remember to hit that like button. Um, if you come across this video, it helps more people see it and helps the channel grow. I really appreciate it. So, the reason I'm here today is Dawn Guard DLC and modding, which the two do not go together. So, in my years of playing Skyrim and modding Skyrim, I have noticed that mods really break the Dawn Guard DLC, and we're here again. Uh, you know, not able to proceed. Uh, because of uh, mods that prevent Valerica and Serana from walking into this area and Valerica opening the box back here that contains the Elder Scroll. You know, she, she and her daughter are outside of this area uh, where we fought Durnavir in the last episode and will not come in. So gonna have to go to the console command so if anybody is having a problem with this and this is what, what I've read hopefully this is gonna work but after you have defeated Dernavir and Valerica and Serana are still outside this uh, area here and won't come in you'll have to go here to this special ornately designed box which contains the Elder Scroll and we're going to need uh, console commands. Okay. Hope this is working right. Yeah, Elder Scrolls chest. And we're just going to go disable. There it is. The Elder Scroll. And now we can take it. All right. So that's what you have to do. Uh, if you find that the uh, NBCs in this area are not moving, uh, you'll have to come back here to the box, select it, you know, go into console commands, select the box, Type disable, and it will reveal the Elder Scroll inside. All right, I just wanted to share that with you, and also, you know, I, 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 I've played Dawn Guard before with a heavily modded game, one that I modded myself. So I, I'm, I'm not, you know, laying any blame on on anybody. Just that this particular DLC seems to be very susceptible to breaking when it comes to to mods. And I'm concerned that the fight with, my God, Harkon. It's like I'm having trouble remembering these names. That's what happens when you get older people. So, you know, that, that boss battle with Harkon um, breaks as well. And I'm hoping, I mean, you know, this is a completely different set of mods. Hoping that we can somehow get through it and actually have the fight. Because I think the last time I encountered the Harkon battle with a game that I modded, I had to use those set stage commands and pretty much skip the fight. I, I wasn't able to participate, but skip the fight to um, advance the game uh, so that the uh, Dawn Guard quest would end. So I'm hoping that will not come to pass in this playthrough, but I'm just putting that out there that that's something that could possibly happen. But anyhow, I hope you enjoyed this little tip. It's good talking with you all, and I hope to see you all soon. And we will continue with our adventures right after this.
Serana. Serana's mother. The Elder Scroll. You should be on your way. Yes, we should. If there's anything I can do before you depart, you must let me know. Um, nothing I can think so of. Get out of this place, the better. Now that you've retrieved the Elder Scroll, you should be on your way. Yes. If there's anything I can do before you depart, you must let me know. Um, can you help get my soul back? So my daughter applied some of the lessons I taught her about necromancy, did she? Don't worry. I think I can help you. Good. I could use all the help I can get. Your soul essence was trapped inside a gem. When you and Serana entered the soul cairn, it was given to the ideal masters as payment. You simply need to retrieve the gem. The moment you touch it, your soul essence will be restored. Any ideas where it could be? There's an offering altar not terribly far from here. I'm willing to bet that the gem you're looking for is there. Is there anything else? Could be your last chance. You're staying here. I have no choice. As I told you before, I'm a daughter of Cold Harbor. If I return to Tamriel, that increases Harkon's likelihood of bringing the tyranny of the sun to fruition. Hmm. Okay, well, just be aware. At least as far as I'm concerned, I may never return. After what I've put Serana through, I would understand if she never wished to see me again. I leave that decision in your hands. Well, Remember, it's not up Harkon to me. is not to be trusted. No matter what he promises, he'll deceive you in order to get what he wants. And promise me you'll keep my daughter safe. She's the only thing of value I have left. Hmm. The That's a shame. Home, the sooner we deal with my father. Look. Do you have anything to ask before you depart? Be quiet. No. The sooner we get the scroll home. Not unless you have something else to say. Farewell. All right, we're leaving. Bye. That Harkon's not to be trusted. Oh, and you. Stay your weapons. I would speak with you, Quinarin. My weapons are stayed. I thought you were dead. Cursed, not dead. Doomed to exist in this form for eternity. Trapped between Laas and Enoch. Between life and death. And why are we speaking? I believe in civility among seasoned warriors. Well. And I find your ear worthy of my words. You're flattering me. My claws have rendered the flesh of innumerable foes. So but have mine. I have never once been felled on the field of battle. Well, welcome to the club. I therefore honor name you Quanarin, or Vanquisher in your tongue. Thank you. I accept that name. I found you equally worthy. Your words do me great honor. My desire to speak with you was born from the result of our battle, Quanarin. I merely wish to respectfully ask a favor of you. Oh, here it comes. Everybody always wants something. What kind of favor? For countless years, I've roamed the Soul Cairn in unintended service to the Ideal Masters. Before this, I roamed the skies above Tamriel. I desire to return there. And what's stopping you? I fear that my time here has taken its toll upon me. I share a bond with this dreaded place. If I ventured far from the Soul Cairn, my strength would begin to wane until I was no more. 
How could I help? I will place my name with you and grant you the right to call my name from Tamriel. Do me this simple honor, and I will fight at your side as your Graze Mazen, your ally, and teach you my Thum. Just call your name in Tamriel. That's it. Trivial in your mind, perhaps. <laughs> For me, it would mean a great deal. I don't require an answer, Quinarin. Simply speak my name to the heavens when you feel the time is right. Okay. Well, well, what, what what's happening? What, something's happening. I feel different. Not sure why. Alright, Serana, Sherry. Let's see. The sooner we get the scroll home, the sooner we deal with my father. Oh, I need to get my soul. Why does it say follow Valerica on the map? when she's behind us. All right, hopefully this is just mislabeled. Let's go this way. I guess I'm stuck here if I can't get my soul back. What do you mean, I guess? I am stuck here. All right. So, I thought these soul husks would help me get back. Apparently not. They may keep my soul from being drained. But it won't allow me to return. Uh-oh. What is it? Something's here, where? Up here. Some space so I can shoot him. And you thought I was just a pretty face. Got it. I'll kill you. Else, 
Still says follow Valerica. Oh boy, look. Oh, this is this thing we saw when we first got here. A storm golem. Or golem, as some people say. Clumsy. For some reason, I can't lock on to it. deal with this first. And I need my soul back. The sooner we get the scroll home, the sooner oh, we deal boy. with the You're gonna be one of those people, aren't you? You know you could run up there and kill it. The sooner we get the scroll home, the sooner we deal with my father. Serana, you could try and help me. Can't you, like, cast a magic bolt or something that would drain its life essence? Isn't that what you do? Rather than just bother me with your incessant prattling. I'll be out of the bolt, thank you the time I kill this thing. Oh, at least I get get a lot of them back. Okay. See, I, I was thinking that interacting with that was giving me my soul back. Apparently not. Uh-oh, more trouble. And I'm running out of dwarven bolts, too. A bone man. There. Says path of souls. Can can I just uh looks like the way out. Will it let me? I've got conflicting information. She said the time that I spent here my body is uh adjusted to this realm. Let's see if I can get out. At least that worked. So I guess all those soul husks and orbs and stuff, I did get my soul back. So what's next? Oh, what is it? Do you need something? Yes, I think we should part ways. Oh, all right then. You know where to find me. Not that I would come looking for you. 
Sherry, let's go. All right, I think we have all three Elder Scrolls. Let me just check some things here. Yes. It's time for us to go and see Dexian. Dexy. De what My the? Trust your journey was successful. Dexian. What, what's going on? I brought the Elder Scrolls. Why? What's with the... I'm sorry, my friend. I can no longer be of use in this matter. What? What happened? It's my fault. In my haste to read the first scroll, I neglected the careful preparation required. I thought I'd be able to allay the after effects, but I was wrong. Now I am paying for it. That covering. Does this mean that you're... Blind? Yes, I'm afraid so. Can anything be done to help you? No. It will have to run its course. And there's always the chance I may never recover. Then we're finished. No, there is another way. What? The question is, how much are you willing to risk to find Oriole's bow? Oh, well... Everything, apparently. What do I need to do? I can't guarantee you'd be free from harm. Becoming blind could be the least of your worries. Don't worry about that, just tell me. Scattered across Tamriel are secluded locations known only as Ancestor Glades. There's one in Skyrim, in the Pine Forest. Performing the ritual of the Ancestor Moth within the Glade should provide the answers you seek. Explain this ritual. It involves carefully removing the bark from a canticle tree, which will in turn attract ancestor moths to you. Once enough of the moths are following, they'll provide you with the second sight needed to decipher the scrolls. Carefully gather the bark. How? In keeping with tradition, you must use a specific tool in the ancestor glade an implement known as a draw knife. Every moth priest is taught this ritual, but few ever get the chance to perform it. You should consider yourself fortunate if it works for you. Do I need to read the scrolls in any particular order? From what I saw in the vision, the Elder Scroll which foreshadows the defiance of the gods with the blood of mortals is the key to the prophecy. What went wrong? Deciphering one of the Elder Scrolls is nothing like reading a simple book. There is quite a bit of ritual and concentration required. It can take months or even years to complete a single scroll, and even then, months to recover. How's a moth related to the Elder Scrolls? Well, as I'm sure you figured out by now, it's no mere coincidence that we're named Moth Priests. The voice of the Ancestor Moth has always been an integral part of reading the, the Elder Scrolls. Moths barely make a sound, let alone speak. Oh, the Moths don't literally read the scrolls, but they maintain a connection to ancient magic that allows the Moth Priests to decipher them. If you listen closely when you find the Glade, you should be able to hear their song, a soft, harmonious trilling. It's through this ancestral chorus that the moths tap into a form of primal augur and become a conduit for deciphering the scrolls. And how does that help moth priests? By oh having the ancestor moths close what to the moth the? priest, they can utilize the conduit and share the moth's augury.
Only the most resilient of priests can do it this way. It takes years of practice to... Didn't I tell home. you that we were parting ways? Then how do I even stand a chance? You've come this far, and you've found several Elder Scrolls. Whether you believe it or not, the Scrolls have a mind of their own. If they did not want you to find them, they would not allow it. Because of this, I strongly believe you were meant to hear the Ancestral Chorus. Only one way to find out. <laughs> okay. All right, if you say so. Good luck. I hope you find the answers you seek. I hope we reach so do I. Soon. I've helped you all that I can. Are you the just going to come around here and just keep repeating the same things over and over and getting on my nerves? I told you we were parting ways. No. Wait here. I'll be here. Come on, Sherry. It's time for us to get to the Ancestor Glade. <laughs>